New images of Sonic 3 have been revealed. Shadow seeks revenge? In the last few hours, multiple news portals have shared new images of Sonic 3, which show us the most important villain or antagonist of this movie, teamed up with one of the previous villains. In this video, we will be talking in detail about these images and what we could expect in Sonic 3. And for more videos of your favorite series and movies, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Welcome to the Oasis Geek. Before starting this video, I invite you to participate in the new giveaway we will be having in this channel, where we will be giving away the first volume of Scarlet Witch by Steve Orlando, a story that will mark the future of the Marvel Universe. To participate, all you have to do is comment which is your favorite moment of the Marvel Universe. The winner will be announced on November 30th. Shadow's story is one of betrayal and sadness, one of disappointment with humanity and an attempt at revenge. It is the story of an experiment that got out of the hands of its creators and now must be stopped to avoid the destruction of the universe. Perhaps the secret of this film lies in these newly revealed images. The revealed images come to us from the website entertainmentweekly.com. In the first image, we can see Knuckles, Sonic and Tails together in a restaurant. This type of restaurant is described as the Chow Gardens restaurant, which is a direct reference to Sonic's Sega video games. To understand what Sonic is doing in this restaurant and why he is making these kinds of expressions, we must begin by explaining what these creatures are. The Chow are fascinating creatures within the universe of Sonic the Hedgehog that you can breed and customize according to your preferences. If you start interacting with them, you will discover that they inhabit areas called Chow Gardens, safe spaces full of nature, where you can take care of them and watch them grow and develop. They originally debuted in the game Sonic Adventure for the Sega Dreamcast console in 1998, where they appeared as small creatures with a rounded appearance, big eyes and bodies that can change color according to their abilities and upbringing. We can say that these creatures in the games are a type of pet, and these garden restaurants are recreational places. Now why is Sonic with his friends in this place? When I mention that the Chao are mystical, it's not just symbolically. Some are believed to have supernatural abilities and can grant us certain advantages in the world. There are rare Chao like the Shine, who tend to take attitudes according to their upbringing, becoming heroes or dark, and this could be one of the reasons why they are in this place. In the image, we can see that Tails is posing for a photo, while Sonic looks annoyed and Knuckles surprised. Apparently, something is going on while they are having their picture taken. Possibly, Sonic and his friends are in this garden looking for a special chow that will help them fight Shadow. But we'll talk about that later. The next picture is of the Robotniks, the professor and his grandson. Professor Robotnik's story often varies in the games and series, but it is generally connected to Shadows, as he was the scientist in charge of creating Project Shadow, a project that sought immortality, which the professor accepted in an attempt to save the life of his granddaughter Maria. This means that while his grandson was fighting Sonic and causing trouble, in the occult, his grandfather was working to create this weapon. We can see that this scene looks like an old laboratory, and it is possible that this is the place where the professor created Shadow. Perhaps he is showing his grandson what his work was like. In the teaser, Robotnik is shown teaming up with Sonic to take on Shadow. But these new images suggest that this alliance won't last long, as we saw an image of Shadow alongside the Robotnik. This image shows us that although Shadow at first will be a threat to the young Robotnik, when he understands that it was a weapon created by his grandfather, he will use it to confront Sonic and I believe that the ultimate goal of the two Robotnik is to control the universe using the power of Shadow and perhaps some special version of the Chao. The next image revealed is one of Shadow in the rain. We can see that his face shows anger or disappointment and as it happens in the rain, it surely is an emotional scene. Perhaps this image shows the moment when Shadow escapes from the laboratory for the first time. 
But who is Shadow really? And what will be his role in the Sonic universe? Shadow's story began very similar to Sonic's. But where Sonic found family and friends, Shadow found only suffering and loss. In the original Sonic lore, Shadow's origin begins many years ago, being as I mentioned, the result of an experiment. The goal of the project was to create the ultimate life form as a weapon for the United Federation. Though Gerald planned to use the results of the project to find a cure for his dying granddaughter, Maria. The name Shadow was chosen for two reasons. One was an irony that a shadow cannot be created, that immortality was impossible and serves as a metaphor for unreal things, while the other came from Maria, who said that shadows could teach people the way to the light. However, the government realized that they were putting too much power in the hands of an unhinged man like Robotnik and ordered the project to be shut down, but it was too late. Shadow's creation had already begun. Gerald was captured, and all the researchers involved in Project Shadow were killed, as well as Maria, who asked Shadow to give all the people of Earth a chance to be happy and to protect them, just before activating the escape capsule where Shadow was helplessly ejected to Earth. Shadow's capsule was recovered by the gun and was placed in suspended animation on Prison Island, where Gerald was forced to continue his research under government supervision. But Robotnik's revenge was just beginning, or so it seems to suggest in these images. But what is Shadow's real purpose? Is he really a villain? Shadow is the result of an experiment and brainwashing by the Robotniks, who manipulated him for their own interests. Although he initially comes across as an antagonist, it is likely that he will eventually join Sonic's side, or at least understand that Robotnik only wishes to use him to fulfill his dark plans. Shadow has impressive power. He can control space and time with the Chaos Emeralds, and his speed is capable of matching Sonic's. However, from his perspective, humans are evil beings who created him only to destroy him later, including Maria, the only person he really cared about. Shadow seeks revenge because he does not understand that he was born into an environment full of evil and manipulation. This makes him the most dangerous experiment ever created. However, deep down, he also has the potential to understand the error in his ways and change his destiny. Now, based on these revealed images, what could we expect from this new Sonic installment? The first thing is that we will have more references to video games and their stories. It will try to be faithful to the original essence while continuing to expand the universe between villains and heroes. I think the story will start with Shadow's escape, and then we will see how Shadow manages to easily defeat Sonic and his friends. Subsequently, they will seek Robotnik's help, only to discover that it was their grandfather who created Shadow, and that now both Robotnik are even more dangerous with Shadow on their side. But tell me, what do you think about all this? What do you think about the new images revealed for Sonic 3? Do you already want to see this movie? What do you think will happen with Shadow? And for more videos of your favorite series and movies, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You are on. The Oasis Geek.